I'm here with Dolores, and she is cooking up us up something awesome. This looks so good, smells so good, and you brought some beer. What's going on? This is one of my very favorite recipes. It is uh, coconut prawns with a sweet dipping sauce. Yum. Uh, very easy to put together and just absolutely delicious. This is one of my cousin Barbara's favorite recipes. And when she has company, she usually cooks these as an appetizer. And they are just wonderful. We'll talk a little bit about what all Whoa. is in it. But look at these gorgeous prawns. That is amazing. And I know Aren't it's going to be good when you bring your fryer. That looks absolutely delicious. Well, Barbara gave me my fryer for Christmas, too. And this is just, it is a oh my wonderful goodness. fryer. We just love it. But I'm going to get this last prawn out of here for right now. And we're going to go over the recipe. Okay, great. Very easy to put together. We've taken two pounds of our wonderful freshwater prawns from Yum. Warren Farms. And you can contact us to get these lobster-like, you know, just treats. They are just wonderful. And what season are they in right now? Well, we have the frozen prawns that are available now and then in the fall we have a fresh harvest where you can come get them fresh, but these are available on our farm year round. Okay. Okay? But we have mixed uh, half a cup of flour here and we've coated our prawns. Then we've Yum. mixed here one and a half cups of self-rising flour, uh, one can of beer and you want this to be the consistency of pancake batter. Okay. We've put uh, half a teaspoon of paprika in it, uh, half a teaspoon of curry powder which I just love, a little salt and a little cayenne pepper and all we're going to do is we're going to take our prawns, we're dip it in there, dip them in there, put them in the coconut. Yum! Oh my goodness this is such a good recipe. And then last but not least is the wonderful sauce that you dip it in. Uh, it's a 10 ounce jar of orange marmalade, mm -hmm. uh, prepared horseradish, three tablespoons, and I'm three so tablespoons of Creole <laughs> mustard. So. This sounds so good. I am so excited as you're preparing this. It's getting me so excited for the tasting later on in the in the day. And this, you said it's really easy. And when, when would be a good time to serve this? Uh, really just for any occasion. Stephen, I had it for supper last night. I baked a Steve school. is so lucky. <laughs> <laughs> this is his favorite. When I told him we were going to have it, he was just really excited. Yeah. But we had a sweet potato and some Brussels sprouts and oh the my coconut gosh. prawns with the sauce. And how many and of these do you eat? 30 of them? I feel like I could go through a whole pound. Well, I tell you what, you'll <laughs> want 30 of them. Believe me, I promise you. So. And welcome back. We've, we've reached almost the end of our show, and Dolores has been working away all morning. If we can get a shot of this amazing... Uh, coconut prawns that you've put together. And how did it go this morning? Oh, that's just gorgeous. Isn't that beautiful? Oh my gosh, it is so beautiful. I think it'd be good if you broke the prawns off the, you know, the sh shell uh -huh. and put it in a sub and made a po' boy oh, with some good dressing. really would be. So good. It? Oh dressing. my God. Dre yeah, you know, I'm getting my southern side <laughs> out. Southern side. Yeah, you know, you've got to dress your po' boy. Hi, Jonathan. I I think I got a request for next week. Huh? Yes. <laughs> no, we, have to, we have to wait till after Lent because I gave up carbs for Lent. Oh, okay. So okay. after Lent, we'll do we'll do the bread and everything. Sounds good. Well, Sounds maybe good. We'll, we'll have a celebration. <laughs> uh, but so how did it go this morning? Everything work out? Oh, yeah. Everything went really well. And it's just such an easy recipe to put together. Uh, we peeled our prawns. And if you'll show this... Uh, we had flour. We just took half a cup of flour mm -hmm. and dredged our prawns in that. Then we mixed our beer batter. It was with uh, 12 ounces of beer, a little bit of cayenne pepper, a fourth of a teaspoon of curry powder, and a fourth of a teaspoon of paprika. You get it to the consistency of pancake batter. Mm -hmm. And then you dip your prawns in and roll them in the coconut. And this is what they look like when they They're are... They're cool. Yeah. And I love that it's not mm -hmm. breaded because I gave up bread, but also because I mean, it's, uh, is it kind of healthier for you, but maybe not because it's fried. Well, you know, I think it's perfectly healthy. Pro Everything good in moderation. Yeah, that is healthy. true. And I think this is such a good, um, a good recipe. If we'd had this maybe over Super Bowl, that would have been so good. You oh, know? it really would. And I think my mom would love this recipe, so I'm very excited to put it up on our, our website and our Facebook page so she can see it. Uh, she needs to get that fryer, though. Oh, the fryer is just out of this world. And the dipping sauce with the prawns is just incredible. So good. And no, tell us what's yeah. in the dipping sauce. Okay, it's a 10-ounce jar of marmalade, and it is three tablespoons of horseradish and three Yum. tablespoons of Creole mustard. And you can really taste that marmalade. It's so good. Oh, yeah. It is just, it's a sort of a 
sweet tart mm -hmm. dip and just complements the coconut beautifully. And, and Jonathan, what do you think? Because you, you've been enjoying it all during the I've whole show. I've been enjoying it. I love coconut. And yeah. I think I've, I, I've been picking at just the, the fried, fried coconut. coconut. <laughs> I think I like that better. But, no, it's very, very good. It gives a little bit of a different taste than a yeah. typical um, fried, sh you know, fried shrimp or fried prawn. Mm -hmm. Um, so it, it, it's actually really good, and I was saying that you could make a tropical drink with it or something. And, yeah, you know. so we, maybe we could have our, your tropical drink with a my po' boy. That would be delicious. <laughs> yes, Coconut it would. and the pineapple, right? <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Welcome back. We've reached the end of our show, and I think we've only got a few seconds, so we might as well take a bite, right, Jonathan? Let's do it. Well, I'll, I need a dipping it. sauce. You just dip oh, in. okay. You just we'll have just to have a double in. dip. Absolutely delicious, isn't it? That combination of flavors is so oh, good. That's good. good. And you can get your freshwater prawns at Lauren Farms and like us on Facebook. Thank you. Always so delicious.